Yo, what's going on everybody? In today's video, we're gonna be using the new 99 overall Royce Lewis. Before we take a look at them though, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn those notifications on and in the comment section below, let me know what you think about Royce Lewis and if you're using them in your lineup or not, all right? Let's go ahead and take a look at Mr. Royce. All right, so we got 99 Royce Lewis. He is the final card in the wild card uh, postseason program, and he went off in the wild card series, hitting two bombs in that first game, and obviously helping the Twins win that first game, and then eventually winning the series. Um, he's a primary third baseman with second base, shortstop, left field, center field, and right field secondaries. So you could play pretty much any position except for first and catcher. And then he's got 125 contact versus right and 125 power versus right without any parallels. He's maxed out there. And then against lefty, he's got 114 contact and 100 power. Um, 80 vision, so vision's not the greatest, but it's not the worst either. 125 clutch, so that's maxed out as well without any parallels. 88 fielding, 79 arm, 80 reaction, 85 speed. So he'll play gold defense at third base or anywhere you put him. Um, regardless of parallels and he also has 99 durability so he does get the cow rip again boost as well as having that shortstop second secondary so you could also put him on a jimmy rollins team build and also get the boost there um, in my opinion obviously the cow boost would fit him better because his contact versus lefties is not maxed out as opposed to it is righties right and jimmy rollins gives you better contact versus righties than lefties uh and cow gives you better contact versus lefties than righties anyways uh, that plus 15 boost would get him to 125 contact versus left without any parallel. And then he also gets a plus 5 fielding boost. So he'll play diamond defense at third base without any parallels. And can also play diamond defense anywhere you put him once you get him to parallel 2. So that also helps out as well with the cow boost. Now if you didn't use any boost, he would get up to 119 contact versus left, 105 power, 85 vision, and then 93 fielding, 84 arm, and 85 reaction with 90 speed. So I think he could play a formidable uh, outfield as well, but I'd rather just keep him in the infield. All right, let's quit talking. Let's go ahead and get into his gameplay. He's going to play third base and hit second. Let's get after it. All right, our opponent's going to be Coop Dave 16. He's got Michael King on the bump, which is a newer starting pitcher. Uh, comes from the September monthly awards program. Haven't faced him yet. We have... Dustin May on the bump. Let's get after it. And strike three. That's Come on. a ball. That was a strikeout. I don't care One what, the, ball, two what strikes. Eric Dick says. He swung. I saw it. Ooh, just made it in that green. Just made it in that Got green. In. One down. Dustin May liked it. He liked the play. Okay, maybe we need to throw down the middle because that was actually You're killing me, small. Maybe even off a little bit off the plate, and he absolutely smoked it. It was actually about two to three inches off the plate. Doctor Smooth, huh? This is a very interesting wild card, but he shows why it's his wild card. Also, that pitch was You're not killing me, Smalls. Where I wanted that, to be quite honest with y'all. As you saw, I was trying to get it above the zone and it did not. I did not get it there. That's going to be a base hit. He is on right now. All right, we got him chasing. All right, 2 nothing deficit going into the bottom of the first. Couple good swings. Let's see what he throws. No outlier for sinker, slur, four seam. That's a good start. That is a good start. Base hit. Through the six hole. Here comes Royce Lewis. Maxed out contact. Maxed out power. Let's do a job. Royce Lewis. In his first at bat. Perfect, perfect. He ties the ball game right up. I mean, if we're going to swing like that, we're going to have a good day with him. That should be a base hit, but of course... It is right at him. He's going. A little bit on top, sure. But that is a great swing right there. Oh, why did I just swing at ball four like an idiot? That is a very unfortunate out right there. I mean, that's a fantastic swing. Perfect, perfect. And it goes to the perfect side of the infield that I wanted. Opposite side. And of course, it ends up on the only spot that could have been an out on that right side of the infield that is very unfortunate Ali Rutschman 
And then, of course, I hit him. him. Okay. I mean, I, I couldn't have served it up any better. Please go foul. It went foul. It went foul. That's tough for him. All right, we're going to get out of the inning. No damage done. Wow. Could have easily been a 4-2 game because we threw him right down the middle. The ball! Damn it. That is, though. All right. Run on first, one out. Gotta be, be I have to be better. It should have been a 3-1 count to freaking Jose, though. Can I get three on this? No. There we go. Didn't miss that one. 5-2. 5-2. Let's go, Royce. Royce again! Two for two with two taters! Oh my goodness, this is shaping up to be in a fantastic debut. Good pitch. Bro, I'm... Okay. I'm gonna leave... Soto in... For maybe... We'll see how he does the rest of this game, but... I feel like I've noticed that the that's the change in the stance from last year to this year is kind of messed me up a little bit with him. I loved Soto last year. Like Soto to me was probably my favorite hitter last year. Uh arguably George Brett was up there too, but Soto definitely was up there. The home run derby Soto. That's a ball. But this year, with that little one change of whatever they put, like kind of like a two-step, or I don't exactly know what they did to one it. One two's the count. Thank you. One down. I'll give him that. He made a good swing there. Just unfortunately, right into the shift. Good. That's another good swing. You're killing right, me, Smalls. Very good pitch. Let's go hit. All right, he gets one back, six to three. And Kenley's coming in. This is a very early spot for him. No. That's in, ball. Doesn't matter if Kenley comes in because Adley's going to smoke one off the wall, unfortunately, not gone. Oh, shoot. Please get there. We're in there, no, thank no, you. No, no, Save. Good piece, of course. Another... Oh, another hard out for Mike Trout. He's got a perfect, perfect line out and a hard ground ball right at the second baseman. That's tough. That is tough. Thank you. I thought that was about to be another perfect, perfect out, bro. Good pitch. I should have never flung that. That was a good pitch. We got him. All right, we got one in the inning. All right, one down. Good swing. You're killing me, Smalls. Uh, all right, two down. Thank you. All right, let's go hit. He got one. He got one again. Let's get it back. All right, we got the just late. I mean that one. Yes, it's just late, but it's it's way over the plate. It's way more over the plate than when he hit. That's a great swing, though. Perfect, perfect. Let's go. 9-8. Or, sorry, 9-4. Royce! 3-for-3. Three three. Yes, sir. His swing is really good. His swing is really damn good. There we go. Okay, that's down. Okay, maybe Soto lives. He's gonna live. That's a good swing right there. <gasps> no, I read it well and I stayed too far back on the cutter. His cutter's slower, so I don't have to stay back on it. I guess I was a little bit. I stayed too much. Stayed back too much on it. All right, Trout. Let's see if we get a good. No way I just missed that with Trout. Well, that's what happens. Sometimes you're just going to miss and it ends up as an 0 for 3 because two of your first two at-bats were good swings and they didn't amount to anything. 
Thank you. Like, I wasn't late on that sinker. I know I wasn't. Oh, that was almost caught. How was that barely over the fence? And our opponent's out of here. We end up winning 12 to 4. Didn't even let us try to get into mercy rule territory. Or to try to mercy rule him. He was just out of here before we could even get there. Royce Lewis ends up having himself a phenomenal debut. He ends up 3 for 3 with 3 runs scored, a single, and 2 bombs with 3 RBI. He was, in my opinion, on pace to being the player of the game. Doing his damn thing, man. He definitely... Has a very nice swing, in my opinion. Um, and somebody that could that could definitely fit into a lineup, especially since he has two different uh, ways to give him boost boosted contact rating. Uh, with that shortstop secondary, Jimmy Rollins boost, and of course that 99 durability, physical Ripken boost. Very nice versatility there where you can use him on two different team builds. So definitely a guy that I um, wouldn't mind having on my God Squad, but now, would I use him on my God Squad currently? I don't know. Um, especially, only thing the downside of him, he has no quirks, right? So there's other guys with this, you know, same positions that he could play, same hitting attributes, possibly even better hitting attributes, and that do have some nice quirks as well. So we know the quirks definitely helps out when it comes to um, guys when they hit. Um, now, again, very nice swing. Gonna play some good defense for you, especially when you have them uh, with the uh, Cal Ripken tier three boost, giving you that plus five fielding. So uh, he could play diamond defense at third, and then he'll play diamond defense anywhere else once you get him to parallel two, get that 95 fielding. So again, very nice card. Um, definitely a card that is worth using, in my opinion, and wouldn't be mad at it if I saw him on a God Squad because his swing is, is very good with the good attributes that he has as well. So uh overall very good card anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already turn those notifications on leave a like on the video and in the comment section below let me know what you think about royce lewis and if he's in your lineup or not all right thank you guys for watching i'll catch you in the next one love y'all peace thank you guys for watching i'll catch you in the next one love y'all peace